December 2nd saw power cuts both in the Kyiv region and elsewhere across the country. In Kyiv and the far off suburbs, power was switched off at 8.41 am Moscow time. Then a spokesperson for the Kyiv Oblenergo grid company has explained that rotating power cuts are now being applied throughout the region due to an emergency at Unit 3 of the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant, which caused a power deficit that could not be immediately compensated for. Power cuts without warning affect people much more severely than it might seem at first sight, paralyzing the water supply and shutting off gas boilers. Suburban cottage towns are particularly vulnerable. Meanwhile, Ukraine's energy authorities said on Wednesday that an accident at a nuclear power plant in Zaporizhia in the southeast of the country posed no danger. There is no threat, there are just problems with the reactors, Energy Minister Vladimir Dimchushin said. But who believe? Anxieties over nuclear safety run high in Ukraine, which continues to struggle with the legacy of the Chernobyl disaster of 1986. Human Rights Watch is dissatisfied with the investigation conducted by the Ukrainian Prosecutor General's Office into the facts of the use of cluster bombs by Ukraine's security forces in the east of the country. Human Rights Watch Executive Director Kenneth Roth told during a briefing in Kyiv on Wednesday. Many have heard that the organization has conducted an investigation in the east of Ukraine and found out that cluster bombs were used in some instances by the pro-government forces in residential areas, he said. However, the Ukrainian Prosecutor General's Office, he said, has failed to conduct the needed investigation. Interference from overseas assuming a leading role in settling sovereignty issues was witnessed in Iraq and Libya and now the same is being attempted in Syria, says Sergei Lavrov. Foreign intrusion by unwanted guests meddling in regional conflicts brings tragedy and the breakup of national states, Russia's top diplomat told his Sudanese counterpart Ali Ahmed Karti on an African visit. Subscribe to our channel to receive up-to-date information on the situation in Ukraine and current geopolitical events in Europe.